Hey guys, what's up? This is Sean Heather and today we are going to do a detailed gaming review of Infinix 05 smartphone. It comes with Helio P25 processor, Mali T 80 GPU, 6 GB of RAM, 6 inch Full HD screen and it runs on Android 7 OS. So we are going to play a few of the most high end games here and we will see that how good this device is going to perform. So let's start it. So first of all, let's start with Asphalt Extreme. So you can see that the audio coming out from this speaker is really loud. It's not so good, not so great in quality, but it's really loud. So the graphics quality is really nice as you can see here. Okay, I guess right. So as you can see that Infinix 05 is performing really good while playing Asphalt Extreme. The graphics quality especially was really nice. Now let's play something else. Let's play Suicide Squad. And all of these games I'm going to play on heavy graphics setting, the highest possible graphics quality. So it will give us better idea about the quality of GPU and its performance while playing games on Infinix 05.
So even while playing Suicide Squad, performance of 05 is good. No frame drops or visible lagging here. Everything is looking nice and smooth and it's a 3D graphics game so you can see that how smoothly camera angle is changing here. So let's go back from here and let's play Asphalt Extreme once again. So you can see that I was playing the Asphalt Extreme, I did close the game and went back to the home screen and started playing Suicide Squad and when I came back to Asphalt Extreme then the game was exactly where I have left it so the 6GB RAM is working perfectly on Infinix 05 here as you can see. Now let's play something else. Let's play Sniper Fury. So the audio is really loud. The sound coming from the speaker. Take out the landing signal officers. So even while playing Sniper Fury, the performance of 05 was pretty good. It is also a 3D graphics game and you could see that I was changing the camera angle so quickly to kill the enemy and uh, 05 performed really good in that without any frame drops or lagging. So let's go back from here and now let's play Suicide Squad. And you can see that the game is starting fresh here. So even with the 6GB RAM, 05 is not capable of running three heavy graphics games side by side. So when I played Asphalt Extreme and Suicide Squad and tried to switch between these two games, it was working perfectly. But when I started playing Sniper Fury and came back to Suicide Squad, it was closed. So at least we can be sure that 05 is capable of running two high-end games side by side. Let's try to go back to a Sniper Fury and it's there. So yeah, we can be sure that we can play two games here at least. And let's play Injustice 2 now. So you can see that my palm is covering the speaker while playing this game. There's no 
So you can see even while playing Injustice 2, 05 is performing pretty good. Graphics quality is great, no frame drops, no lagging, uh, no issues of any kind. So everything is nice and smooth here on Injustice 2 as well. Now let's play something else. Let's play UFC. It's also a very heavy graphics game. So here performance of 05 is quite good as well. You can see that this is also a very heavy graphics game. Lots of details in characters and everything in the gameplay. And uh, 05 is performing quite good. And now let's play MC5. So here 05 Strike is performing water, good as well, eliminated. it's a heavy graphics game so there is no frame drops or any kind of delay and you can see that this is a 3D graphics game and when I'm changing the camera angles everything is so nice and smooth, no frame drops, no aliasing or any issue while playing MC5 here. So let's play it for a while. There was a slight frame drop just now.
So it seems performance of Euro 5 is quite good while playing MC5. As you can see, everything is nice and smooth. There were some few drops, a bit, but not too much. As you can see, this is a very heavy graphics game. Lots of 3 graphics. So you can see that performance of Zero 5 is really nice while playing modern combat as well. Just few frame drops here and there. Other than that everything is so nice and smooth. And now let's play Dead Trigger 2. Alright, let's go. So you can see even while playing Dead Trigger 2 performance of Zero 5 is quite good. Graphics quality is really nice, no frame drops, everything is nice and smooth. This is also a 3D graphics game and you can see no frame drops are happening, no lagging. So overall gaming performance of Infinix 05 is nice and impressive. The graphics quality is good. Most of the time there is no frame drops, no lagging, everything is nice and smooth. While playing MC5 there were slight frame drops. Other than that everything was nice and smooth. The 3D graphics rendering is quite good. The audio is really loud and clear as you can see. Though the speaker quality is not great. But it's still, for the gameplay, it's really nice. Get the, car! the only problem I faced while playing high-end games on in Phoenix 05 was that the 6 GB RAM is still not sufficient for multitasking and if you are planning to play a few of the most high-end games side by side like 3-4 games then 05 will disappoint you a bit because when we started playing 3 games at the same time then one of the game was force closed. 
Other than this and few frame drops in Modern Combat 5, everything was nice and smooth on our Infinix 05 while playing few of the most high-end games. And even after playing all of these games for nearly 30 minutes, the 05 is not warm at all. The screen is at normal temperature and so is the back panel. Everything is at normal temperature. Just slight warm, very very less warm. I think it's just because of uh, me holding the device for like 30 minutes like this. Otherwise, there is not slight heating even though this device comes with full metal body. So it's supposed to be a bit hot and warm while playing most of the high-end games. But still, the 05 is still cool. So this is a very nice thing about 05 for gamers. So that's all for now friends. Thanks for watching the video. And do not forget to subscribe the channel for more videos, tips and tricks, and hands-on reviews like this. I'll see you guys next time in an another video. Have a nice day.